Lynn won in 2002. So <coughs> we have high hopes here. Uh, so this goes to, probably no surprise to most of you, to finance major and investments club president, uh, Jesse Roberts. She actually won the triple crown, we're calling it this year, uh, of uh, senior awards. She was named homecoming queen. Uh, also, strangely enough, finance senior Bernie Aguirre won homecoming queen, so finance is smart and royal. Uh, she is also, obviously, finance uh, student of the year. Uh, and then last, Jesse won the Freedom Medal. The University of Arizona gets out six awards to outstanding seniors, just a total of six. Jesse was one of the University Outstanding Senior Awards medal winners with the Freedom Medal. She's made significant contributions to the other college and the finance major. Uh, she continued to run the annual Women in Finance brunch to expand the female presence in the department, not only in finance, but also in economic accounting. Uh, and she co-founded this year's Women in Finance speaker series, uh, which was a great success. After her internship on Wall Street with UBS last summer, Jesse interviewed for a full-time position and accepted an offer on the Foreign Exchange Sales and Training Desk at UBS in New York. She's actually spending a month in London doing training and then going to New York after that. So a very exciting year coming up for Jesse. Her hard work and winning attitude has paid huge dividends, so just much come up here and say a few words. Way back when, when we all walked into MIS 111 with the other 800 pre-business students. And after that first applied business project, we kind of started thinking maybe we made a whole mistake with this uh, business thing. And then we walked into p 277 with Umashanker and we knew we made a mistake with the whole business thing. Um, but really, how did we pick finance as our majors? There's no finance class for pre-business students, so we really had no idea what we were getting into. But I'm going to take a guess that you probably had a similar process as me. As a pre-business student, I was interested in you know maybe accounting or finance. I liked math, so um, I thought those were two good options. And then I took accounting 200 and decided I was going to be a finance major. <laughs> but on a serious note, we all changed the trajectory of our life when we chose finance as our major. <clears throat> Whether you chose finance because you wanted to understand the way, the way the world worked or maybe because you're grossly obsessed with Wall Street, because of that decision, we are going to enter the real world prepared with not only the technical skills necessary to be successful, but with the work ethic, work ethic and drive that being a finance major has taught us. Somehow we made it through professional missions and we were now officially finance majors. Finance 360 gave us that little bit of hope that maybe we could be successful in finance. We started learning things about uh, that we could actually apply in the real world, time value of money. Um, but then we took accounting 400 and had all of our dreams crushed. <laughs> but it made us more grateful that we were accounting majors, so we got fair. <clears throat> we all knew first semester was going to be pretty tough, but we're semi-excited because we finally got to take some actual finance-related courses. <clears throat> But sadly, we ended up spending a majority of our time with our lovely BCom groups and testing our luck by skipping Vic's marketing class and just praying we didn't call our name that day. <laughs> but then we get to second semester LR, and now we actually get into real finance curriculum, corporate finance and investments, and we immediately began learning from CAPM to calculating cash flow from operations. Soon we found ourselves applying these skills in the real world. How else did we all convince our parents to pay for Cabo Spring Break if it wasn't for our Excel budgets? And if any of you parents here fell victim to that, I'm pretty sure we had it in here somewhere. <laughs> uh, and then something crazy happens. We actually get to start choosing the classes we want to take for ourselves, and we got welcome to the world of finance electives. But this actually was a really cool time because we actually got to figure out the different career paths that are available to us as finance majors from real estate to international finance to derivatives to whatever financial intermediaries is. Um, the true magic of this degree is that it can literally take you anywhere. I mean, look around and think about all the different places we're going. From San Francisco, Dallas, Chicago, Phoenix, Newport Beach, New York, 
St. Louis, Salt Lake City, the opportunities are truly endless. In this room <clears throat> is the next CFO of Apple, the next Warren Buffett, the next Secretary of the Treasury, the next Chairman of the Federal Reserve, maybe even the next President, probably not them. <laughs> <laughs> this department is so special. We all have such a unique bond with this place and this major. When we look back, we're gonna remember our favorite professors. We're gonna remember Kale making students sing when they were late or their phone went off. We're gonna remember being painfully nervous anytime we found ourselves talking to Arvin. We're gonna remember wandering into Jeff or Andrew's office and hoping somehow they'll figure out our life for us. We're gonna remember the heated debates we have with each other about where we think oil prices are gonna be trading at the end of 2017. I think that one was probably just me, but. <laughs> <laughs> we have become a part of the family. We care about each other, we mentor each other, we push each other. It's so nice knowing that we will always have a home to come back to in Tucson, and the finance department will be waiting with open arms. As we've hopefully learned, the stock market has its ups and downs, just like our time here as finance majors. But looking around, I'm very bullish on all of our futures. Mm. The real journey is just now beginning. I'm so excited to see where all of these different roads take us. Thank you for an incredible journey, and everyone, congratulations. Yay.